Hello, I'm Dr. Nate uh, Berger. I'm director of the uh, Center for Science, Health, and Society at uh, Case Western Reserve University School of Medicine. I'm here today to talk to you about our summer research program for high school students. The program is called the SEO Yes program. The uh, SEO part is the Scientific Enrichment and Opportunity Program. We started it in 2004 to encourage high school students from the Cleveland area to learn about and to participate in all forms of biomedical research and healthcare delivery, and also to uh, pursue careers in research and healthcare delivery. The YES component, which stands for Youth Engaged in Science, was added in 2017. The YES component is supported by the National Cancer Institute and is focused on engaging underrepresented minority students in cancer research and career development. The overall program has a very strong cancer research orientation although all aspects of medical uh, research are included. The major focus of uh, the program is to provide high school students with the opportunity to get deeply involved in an individually mentored, hands-on biomedical research project in the laboratories or programs with our outstanding faculty members, researchers at the CWRU School of Medicine. Each student in the, selected for the program is assigned to a research project based on the student's interest and experience where they conduct research on um, a full-time basis during the months of June and July. The program starts with uh, training of the students in laboratory safety, and responsible conduct of research. We expect the students to work full-time, 40 hours uh, a week for the eight weeks of the program. The program ends with each student making a presentation of their research accomplishments at a capstone uh, poster session at the end of July. The exact dates of the program are June 5th to July 28th. Students are expected to participate for the full out eight weeks. It doesn't really work very well with other jobs or daytime activities or family vacations. We expect that you will be there the full eight weeks of the program. All the students are provided with stipends, $1,250 per month or $2,500 for the eight weeks of the program. Uh, in addition to the research activities, there are a number of other uh, program activities. Uh, all of the students participate in lunch and learn seminars every Tuesday and Thursday, where we introduce you to important developments in scientific research. Uh, we have every week what we call career cafes, where we introduce you to specialists in various aspects of biomedical research and medicine uh, and give you an opportunity to ask questions uh, and uh, discuss different aspects of uh, medical uh, practice. We have college preparation uh, seminars where we talk to you about the ACT and the SAT, uh, rather the ACT uh, exam, and also about the differences between going to, say, big city and small town colleges, large colleges, small colleges, Ivy League colleges, historically Black universities, and other uh, college uh, types. Uh, we have uh, weekly discussions on science in the news, that is, uh, areas where science impacts uh, your everyday life. We have writing workshops for students who are uh, interested, uh, where on a twice weekly basis, we teach you uh, how or help you to learn how to read and write science and also to work on constructing your uh, college application essays. And we have a variety of other 
uh, activities to help you become more acquainted with biomedical uh, research. Uh, the program is open to all Northeast Ohio high school students. Uh, there is a preference for underrepresented minority students, but the program is open to all students. You have to be, uh, we require that you're at least 14 years old at the time the program starts. You need to have a grade point average of three or uh, better in order to apply. Uh, and all students who are accepted to the program must have uh, their COVID vaccine uh, and boosters if eligible by the time uh, the program uh, opens in June. Uh, applications are open, are available and open now online. Uh, in order to find uh, the program, you can go online and look at CWRU Youth Engaged in Science. When that page opens up, you'll see uh, a list of menus on the left. Go down to where it says application and then open it up. There's a uh, Qualtrics application, which you can fill out online. Uh, in addition to completing the application, you need to send us two letters of recommendation. One has to be from one of your high school science teachers and another from one of your guidance counselors. Uh, we also require that you send us your high school transcript and uh, that you have at the time of your application that you have permission granted by uh, either uh, one of your parents or uh, your guardian. Uh, the deadline for applications is February 24th. Uh, if you have any problem accessing uh, the applications or if you have questions about it, you can contact uh, the program coordinator. His name is Mr. Render. He's the SEO Yes program coordinator and his email address is jxr488 at kcase.edu. I'll repeat that. It's uh, Mr. Render at jxr488 at kcase.edu. Uh, or uh, the other uh, person who should be fully knowledgeable and can help you uh, with any questions that you have about the program is your high school guidance counselor. Again, the deadline for applications is February uh, 24th. Uh, the applications are reviewed by a panel of high school uh, guidance counselors and uh, Case Western Reserve University School of Medicine faculty researchers. Uh, the uh, students are uh, selected to participate in the program and notified uh, usually shortly after your spring uh, break. Again, the program starts on June uh, 5th and goes all the way uh, through till July 28th. Uh, we look forward to seeing you uh, some to seeing some of you this summer. Uh, thank you and good luck.